Hey guys, today we're gonna do some repairs. All right, so I got these really cool nozzles from T-Jet. I'll let you uh, swap them in and out real quick. And uh, the problem I have is it doesn't fit on here. I don't know if I got the wrong adapter or what, but it fits on here. And then this is pretty much the right size for this, but just off by a little bit. So what I found is, is you can force it in like this. Oh, I guess a little new device. And it'll have a nice snug fit. Before doing a renovation, it's important to fix any equipment that you may have broken in the garage because it was a mess and you left something on the ground and broke it by stepping on it. Ooh, this feels a lot nicer. Alright, let's see here. Boom, point of no return. Snug enough where I don't think this is necessary, but whatever. It's there, so it might as well, you know. Mm -hmm. Nice. Hmm. Well, this one's got a longer handle, so the angle's different, but it's a lot easier to push. So I think long term this would be nicer. I also like the angle of the tip. I think that one had an angle too, but it wasn't it wasn't as much. Which is why I think I uh, have a habit of whipping back and forth. So this little repair kit is universal. It's got a whole bunch of parts. I don't know what this is for. Maybe it replaces other stuff. Got some little rinky-dink nozzles. Got this thing. Don't know what that is. Um, but here's the deal. I mean, if you just get these nozzles, I'm sure they work fine. But I really, really like these T-Jets. I like, first off, I like the quick net. I mean, it's still tough. It seals nice, but it uh, makes it a lot easier for switching back and forth. And I'm going to show you the nozzles. We've got two. One is for spraying big droplets for like soil applications. So think pre-emergence. Uh, think soil conditioners. Uh, fungicides for soil applications. That I'm pretty sure is this one, but I'll I'll double check in the video. And this one has a finer mist for killing weeds or for foliar applications of fungicides. So you can just pop it on, spray. You want to switch it, pop a different one on. They get a whole collection of different kinds. Um, so yeah makes it a lot easier than having to fiddle too much. All right, so there you have it. Uh, I'll put links in the description to the types of nozzles that I use. And the backpack sprayer from um, Harbor Freight, it's super cheap, but I mean, unless you're using it constantly, it gets the job done. Um, I haven't personally used any higher end backpack sprayers, so I don't know what I'm missing on those ones. So if you're just like me, the average Joe Schmo homeowner, Get the backpack sprayer there and then spend the money on the good nozzles. Alright, so uh, thanks for watching my video. 
I'm gonna try to keep the progress going. I've been having migraines all week and so many different things going on that, uh, like look at this. You see this? My wife's taking over part of the lawn again, so I gotta figure out what I'm doing with that. And then I did videos and the sound didn't come out right because I forgot to plug the mic in and... But anyways, 